one brick ships 1912 here and today I thought we'd do something a little bit different and we would go and make a working Titanic in G mod because I have a Titanic model and I want to just play around with it so without any more stalling let's begin all right everyone here we are in the the water map that I have chosen that we will do this in so at first I have a lot of add-ons for this game. Let's find where it is. Ocean Liner Parts. And we want this one. So here's what we're going to be working with. We're going to try and make it a drivable Titanic. No, it doesn't have interiors, doesn't have all that jazz, but it is a good model. Right, so, we want to do this, don't we? Okay, so, there is propellers, we want a three-bladed. And chunk. Now we want to get this, a motor. No, you don't want it to be And we want it to have a force time because it wouldn't be like straight on that it would start up. Pow. No, hang on, what what is it? Eight and five. Oh, I know, it's, I know it's a problem. Hang on. Put that like that. I have it frozen, so, you know, it wasn't going to spin if it was frozen. So we want to try and get this dead on the center. Now, that's one, one propeller. Now, does it, do we do damage if we, oh no, oops, alright, three bladed, and stop it right there, go to the motor, bang, and get it, bang there, alright, now we need another one. The motor. Gotta unfreeze them. There we go. We got <laughs> we got Titanic's props on there. Okay, now we want a three bladed. Is there a three blade? Come on, there's got to be a three bladed. Okay, we're gonna have to do an Olympic. This isn't Titanic no more, it's Olympic. There's a big one than that. There we go, that's better. Now we want motor. Actually, we want to. Give this one a little bit more, a little bit more, just because it is the more powerful of the two. Wait. Now it does have the backwards option, so sorry about that everyone, it's not entirely accurate. And that thing spins so fast. Alright. Let's do some details on the top deck now. For the rope. Let's do the mast wiring. Three 
three wires should do it, I think. One. in check now oops don't mind that now this wouldn't go that far it would go to like that there. I will I would try and do the um the Marconi wires but I don't have enough skill to pull that off. So we're just going to do one wire across there. And one all the way to the forepeak. Now. Now there was one master wire here. Wow. It's a bit goofy, I know, but... And then there was one going from the bridge. To the... I think there was one from the first funnel to the forward mast. Let's do that right now. There. Let's get these funnel wires attached. Now and now, what now? And what now? What now? And how? Okay, I'm gonna move them. I'm going to do one here. And one here. Not there. That means this needs to really go out wide. Right to there. And this one, not so much. That's a bit better. Then we go here. And the next one down there. I might just add like another row in the center. Alright, so it goes down, down to this corner. Two, not that far. Three, straight down practically. Four, cross. There we go, we have the first funnel wired up. The mast wiring, sort of. Starting to look like a real ship. Alright, I'm going to do a time lapse of me doing this, just so you guys don't have to watch me do it all over again.
so I've done the wiring of all of the funnels and everything. They all still work. Now we need to put this so it can float. Which this doesn't, this game doesn't really take floating into account, so we're going to have to use these. Hoverball. If we do this, it floats now. And we can lower it in the water. Ooh, there she goes. So if we do this, take a while. She does shake. on her just to control her, um, her direction, stop her right there, raise her up, get her out of the water, we're just going to make it, make it not really noticeable, but give them a little bit more force. And then I'd say we need that one. Let's go two. I think maybe you need to be stopped. Alright, now, I can't get this rudder to move. Even if I wanted to. So we're going to have to use thrusters again, make... Uh, no effect, and none sound. Now we want eight and five, no, maybe seven and four. But instead of putting them on the ship, I'm just going to put about three there, maybe five. So let me push. Hang on, the ship is frozen. She turns now! Okay, 
do stop spazzing out. Mm. Now we're going to freeze her again. And we're going to go up here. And do some work on our bridge. Make this more of a place where you can drive it. So, what's a ship without a home? That's roughly in the center. Now you want the well to well to ship. Ow. Oh god, it killed me. The Titanic claimed another soul. Okay, so now we want to get some telegraphs. Three on this side, two on the other. God dang it. Okay, so now we have the three. the ship. One, two, there we go. Now we want the uh, one again. Hold. See if anything's holding her down. We'll Let's put her back into the water, shall we? Looks like she's floating now. Now there is no stairs here, hang on. Now I'm um, just checking if I got my mic going, everyone. I have a um, history of not doing that. Uh, so let her sit. Now, to be able to drive this thing, we're going to need to be able to sit somewhere, so... It's not going to be a pretty chair, it's just going to be... A chair. I grab the ship, I want the chair. Chair. This is exactly how the Titanic was was driven. It was driven by a chair. So you get into it. I'm sitting on the bridge of the Titanic. Alright, so what else do we need? We don't need lifeboats, who needs them? Who needs them? We need some lights. We need the port and starboard lights. So I must say this is the port side that's not red. That's the port. This is the starboard. That's not in the correct position. There we go. We got both red and green. Lights, now there would have been... Now lamps, we could do something with the lamps. Give it a bit of a yellowy tint. Now 
if we go like like that, it's a Titanic's funnels being written up. Another lamp. Another lamp. Two lamp. And three lamp. Whoa. Yeah. 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 Behave. There we go. One. Two, and three, that uh, wrong one, well, weld them to the ship, So, everyone, we've built the Titanic in, um, Gmod. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, God. Up. Oh. you. Alright, let's... Let's get her moving, shall we? Let's get an underwater shot of them. Them props going. Let's actually... One freezer. Why isn't nothing moving? It was you. Wait, it's bring her backwards. Put all your effort into it. Put bring them in. He's going. I'm holding both buttons, but she is moving by herself. Now that's actually there is something we we have forgotten. She is a steamship, right? Where are my emitters? There we go. The scale shall be huge. Now this one did have smoke coming out of it, so don't growl at me in the comment section, I know what I'm doing. One more on each. Except for the last one, because the last one wouldn't have had much. Alright, so, we now have the Titanic ready for her maiden voyage. Let's get her moving. Nope, wrong one. Here she goes. Oh, I have a toggle on it. I just gonna have one. Sorry about this, everyone. I'm just gonna... Three, three, press one, how did I miss a funnel, there we go, now she's steaming.
Right. Here she goes. Sorry, I have to keep pressing this. There we go. Sorry if anyone is wearing headphones. We have the Titanic leaving port. Don't worry, that's just her engines, that sound. Things are really, really loud back here. Her propellers are not on fire, trust me. There she goes. There she goes, everyone. Off to go meet her iceberg. Alright, I think that's what I'm... I might call that, that a video right here. So, thank you all for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Just me goofing around in... Gmod building the RMS Titanic out of a model. So, if you did enjoy, please like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I will see you all in the next video. Goodbye, everyone.